How do you name variants here in Figma? So when we have components, we can have variations of that component. We're gonna click on properties over here and we're gonna click new variant. Now from here, this gives it a variant property, but it also means we can add variants. So if we add one, we've got this button here and let's say this button, for instance, is gonna be a yellow button. We have two variants here. And when we select one or the other, we can see the current variant change in property value. This one is default, and then we also have this variant too. Now you might want to rename these. You could keep the default button, but maybe we want this to be named yellow button instead of variant two. If we click on the drop down menu here, we can actually go to rename. And we can put in a new value for this. For instance, we could call this yellow button. Press return, and now this variant's name is yellow button. This one is default. Maybe we want this to be white button. So we have yellow button and we have a white button. The cool thing about this is when we go back to our actual document here, and we'll zoom out a little bit. So that is just the original component. If I go to my assets and bring this component out, I have variants over here I can uh, utilize. So when we select that component over here on the right hand side, we can see that we have properties. Now you can adjust this white button or you could select the, from the drop down list the yellow button, just like that. Now if you want to rename the actual property itself, you need to go to the main component. So you can actually click this button right here to go to the main component if you have an instance of the component selected. Otherwise just navigate to it, select the whole component, so you can click on the name of the component up here. Over in your properties, as we hover over, we see this tab right here where we can edit the property. So this is editing the name of the variant itself, not just the values inside of it. So inside of here, we might call this button color, for instance. So this variant property changes the color of the button. So we could go back over to this instance of the button, select it, and you can see button color is in here, and it could change between white and yellow. Now, this is just one little example uh, to make it kind of obvious. It might not be exactly how I would do button color changes, but that's how you can name variants, both the variant and the value here on Figma.